Hunting was a main part of tribal life. The deer was a very precious animal to the tribal people. The hides were used for blankets and clothing. The bones were used for tools and needles for sewing. The tribal people used every part of the deer and ate the meat that fed a lot of tribal people. The tribal men who were chosen for hunters took the young tribal boys to learn to hunt. In camp, the women prepared the meat for the winter. Most of the meat was dried or made into pemmican. The deer hides were tanned to make warm clothes for the winter. The hides were first soaked in water for three to four days, or long enough so the hair would come off of the deer hide easily. The hair was scraped off with a scraper. The other side was also scraped clean of all pieces of meat and fat. The deer hide was then put into a container and soaked with deer brains. It was soaked until it was soft. The deer hide was then taken out of the soaking solution and wrapped around a tree. The hide was wrung out as dry as it could be. This sometimes took a half an hour, depending on the thickness of the hide. After it was unwrung and wrung out dry, it was ready to be put on the tannin frame. The hide was stretched and placed on a frame. It was poked gently with a blunt stick or deer antler to soften the hide. It was done very carefully in order not to poke a hole in the hide. The women poked it until it was dry. After it was dry, it was unlaced and taken off the frame. The hide was then sewn up one side, leaving both ends open. The hide was hung over a low fire of coals. A certain kind of wood was burned to smoke the hide. It was smoked to the desired color. Finally, the hide was ready to cut and sew into moccasins or shirts or a buckskin dress.